So after my near miss were having to potentially pay £150 to have the engine management warning light code red I've decided to get a code reader, let's call it OBD2 reader I'm going to research um, which one to get just to make sure it works because apparently the cheap ones don't give many codes up just a few engine codes when you want to cover the bulk of the codes generated by a Land Rover so that's one thing that's come up in my research anyway so where is the OBD socket that you plug the code reader into so you can check what the engine management warning light says well it's under the driver's side go down here and there it is hiding away that's the OBD2 socket where you plug in your reader Put the phone down there to give me extra light so it's on the left of the steering wheel just there you just apparently just plug it in and then you can read the codes and even monitor like I said I'm going to do some research before I buy one I was going to buy a cheap one then after reading up they say they don't cover many codes just a few engine ones so it's best to research before you buy I could say they were going to charge me 150 and even the local garages they would charge at least 50 pounds maybe 60 to read the code just to read the code anyway that's where it is to the left of the driver near the console pretty easy to access just plug it in I think you're gonna get, have to get one with a cable it's the position so it's not just one of those that you slot in because I don't think enough room those Wi-Fi this cheap Wi-Fi one they can just slot in I don't think there's enough room for that so you need to have one with a cable and a display so I'm gonna not get a cheap one I'm gonna probably I'm looking at something around 70 pounds which is still half what the dealer would have charged me you know to read the codes so it's going to be well worth it plus you can monitor as you drive you know, I don't know what, how much use that will be to a, just an ordinary owner anyway so now you know where the socket is OBD2 and that's the way it looks like Hmm, so do check out my next video when I actually buy one after some research, plug it in and see what comes up.